Hey guys, welcome back to Ocean WP tutorial videos. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to access your page title settings, as well as show you how to hide it on each and every individual page. Stay tuned. So, first things first, what we need to do, as we always do, is we head over to our dashboard dashboard over there and I'm in the pages section and I'm just going to create a new page. Brilliant. And we're going to call this page. Um, I don't know. Let's call it. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. So I'm going to publish that. All right. I'm going to say view page and I'm just going to select the customize button over here. Awesome. And now you can see over here that we have our title and there is our widget section over there, our sidebar. Now, a lot of the time by default, the page title is visible on your page and you don't really want to have that there. In some cases it might be, you know, useful. It might fit your design in some way or other. But in this, in this case, I, I want to get rid of it. I want to have the option to kind of, you know, look, I don't want to have this on my page. How do I get rid of it? So it's pretty simple. All we do is we go over to the general options tab over here and we select the page title option. Now, in this case, it gives us, it gives us five options. All right. We can either hide it on all devices. So we can hide it on desktops, laptops, tablets, or we can hide it on tablet and mobile. In that case, it'll only be visible on desktop. If we can, if we hide it on mobile, it'll be visible on tablet and desktop. And if we hide it on tablet, it'll be visible on mobile and desktop. And in this case, it'll be visible on, on all devices. So if I select hide on tablet and mobile, you'll see that nothing's going to change. That should stay there. But if we select hide on all desk on all devices, you'll see that it disappears. So just like that, that is, that gives us the option to hide our, our page title. Okay. And if we go back to that section and say show on all devices, there are a few more options that we have to customize. So like over here, we have a breadcrumb. It's like a little, a, 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 it's a term for saying there are some clues to let the client or the person know where we are on the site. So I'm just going to select disable breadcrumbs. And like that, that's gone over there. Uh, show item title. I don't think there is an item title on this page though. No, there isn't. Um, and if we go back to enable breadcrumbs, select that. All right, that was the item title. Now we can choose the selector or the separator. That should change if we save that now and reload the page. And then over here, we have a whole bunch of um, other options that we can add to the page. So you can change the text color, the separator, the color of the link when you hover over it. So if I just check on that, let's change that to green. If we hover over it, it's now green. You get the point. Now it's pink and so on and so forth. So just like that, that's, that's the, you know, you go into the general options tab. And you go to page title and he'll have all the different, you know, we can even change it to a header three. So that'll be a little bit smaller now like that, or we can change it to a header six. It might be set to a default header one. Change the set, the styling to centered like that centered minimal. change the padding we can make the background color so that's if you want to enable that if not play around with whatever you think might be best for your design but that's how you that's how you hide the title thanks guys